So I made this AC model and it currently has four materials and the UV map looks like this, quite messy. And in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to get a clean UV and reduce those four materials to one. So the first thing you need to do is go to the UV editing tab. Then let's open this menu and under the point UV maps, just create a new UV map. Call this new UV for example and select this, press A, U, smart UV project and I would recommend an island margin of 0.005, then click OK. And you see what the island margin does is it makes those little spaces so we can get a cleaner bake. The next step is go to shading and from here you can see all these textures. And what I will do is grab an image texture like that and let's call this AC underscore base color because I want to bake the base color and let's set this to 4096 by 4096. Turn off the alpha and click OK. Nice. Now we need a UV map node. This goes into here and select the new UV. Then let's copy and paste this node and the old UV map goes into the old material. Okay, now we can just copy this whole setup. Control C, then paste it here, Control V. Then just connect all these inputs, outputs. And for the rubber material, I have no texture, so I don't need the UV map here. And an important thing is to select the model and you have to select the new UV and then select all the textures you're baking to. So all of these. Then let's go to cycles, GPU compute and on the light paths, let's reduce it a bit because otherwise the bake will just take ages. You can turn the transmission and transparent to zero. It really doesn't matter because we have no translucent materials here. And let's set the max samples to 200. Then let's go to bake. And here I will set the bake type to diffuse because I want to bake the base color. Then turn off direct and indirect lighting and you get only the color. And I will set the margin to something like 2000 because I just want the whole texture filled instead of having some black spots. And now the only thing left to do is click on bake. Okay, and after baking the texture will appear on the left. Make sure to save it, otherwise it will disappear. At this point you can bake your other textures like roughness, metalness, normal and so on. Or you can create the roughness map on my website unrealmeta.net with the free PBR texture generator and you can make your own adjustments here. And if you have baked everything, you can just delete all the materials, then create a new material and you just have one material now. And let's get the image texture and the bake from before, so the AC base color. And now we have to delete the old UV map. The new UV map gets applied and you see it got baked perfectly fine. If you want to know how to bake the ambient occlusion, I also made a video on that. And yeah, I hope you liked this video and see you next time.